Now we're going to talk about the Bayou uh, hybrid rape, hybrid kale. It's a cross between rape and kale. Uh, and as such, it has some really distinctive properties, uh, mainly which is that it probably has as good a cold tolerance as any of the brassicas that we offer. So this is one that we would uh, normally use uh, planted in the late summer, Dale, mm -hmm. for when we want that brassica to grow out into the winter as long as possible uh, for a late season grazing. That's where it really shines. That's where it's really good. But from an April planting, this looks pretty darn good. Uh, it's probably not quite as growthy. The leaves aren't as big as some of the hybrid turnips or the collards or things like that. Uh, but still very respectable. Uh, Dale, what, what are you seeing out here in this uh, uh, plot? Well, one thing we do like about it, as you mentioned, is the late fall grazing potential of this. But another pro uh, goal for this product, if you look, you see all these little holes all over the leaves. Uh, those are from uh, uh, what a lot of people would call cabbage worms, uh, some caterpillars that are soft-bodied, airless. Um, this is a tremendous product for putting in food plots because those little, especially in a spring planting, because all those little caterpillars that are doing this damage, those are just like Twinkies for, for newly hatched game birds. They're high, in, well, Twinkies aren't nutritious <laughs> as cabbage worms are. But, but the, both cream filled. Yeah, they are cream filled. <laughs> but I mean, this is a, a high protein snack that's easy to catch for upland game bird chicks right after hatching. So this is something it's also very palatable to deer, um, uh, the turkeys, I mean, just all kinds of wildlife really relish uh, brassicas to eat. And also, uh, some of the brassicas are very attractive to these cabbage worms that provide an easy meal. Mm -hmm. So kind of a versatile plant, again, uh, probably wouldn't be my first choice for an April planting a lot of times uh, for grazing animals on, uh, but certainly when we are, would be talking about an August planting, it's going to be one of the first things we can go to. And this seems to be a product that more and more people are requesting. Yep. So, performed well. Yes, it has.